Welcome to the Kentucky Press Association's Advertising Excellence in Kentucky Contest. Now let's review the results. The Kentucky Press Association wishes to thank the members of the Maine Press Association for judging our contest. Category 1, Department Discount Jewelry. Weekly 3, first place goes to Kim Hupman and Eva Jo Nugent from the Lebanon Enterprise. The same two take second and third place. Multi-weekly, first place goes to Donna Wilhite, Kentucky Standard. Multi-weekly, two goes to Kim Hupman, Kentucky Standard. Daily two, first place to Sonia Foster, News Enterprise. Second place goes to Sonia Foster, the uh, News Enterprise. Third place goes to Tony Atkins, the Daily Independent. Story two, automotive. Weekly one, first and second, both go to Daryl Taylor and Deborah Garrett with the News Democrat. And in third place, it's Sarah Tackett and Neil Belcher, the Foundlet Outlook. Automotive, weekly two, first place to Jeff Botkin and Sonia Foster, Central Kentucky News Journal. Weekly two, second place to Kimberly Sees, Bourbon County Citizen. And weekly two, third place to Susie LaCour in graphics and Madison Ward in sales with the Cynthiana Democrat. Automotive, weekly three, first place to Bill Mathers and Amanda Richards. Casey County News. Automotive Weekly 3, second place to Kim Huffman and Eva Jo Nugent, Lebanon Enterprise. Automotive Weekly 3, third place to Beth Holmes and Mindy Yarberry, Adair County Community Voice. Automotive Multi Weekly, first place to Kim Huffman, Kentucky Standard. Multi Weekly, second place to Donna Wilhite, Kentucky Standard. And multi weekly third place, Donna Wilhite, Kentucky Standard. Automotive, daily two, first place to Tony Adkins, the Daily Independent. Automotive, daily two, second place, Mary Latek, the State Journal. And automotive, daily two, third place to Bill Mathers and Nancy Farmer, the News Enterprise. Category three, hardware appliance stores, weekly one. First and second place both go to Daryl Taylor and Deborah Garrett, the News Democrat. And in third place, it's Kim Huffman, Springfield Sun. Hardware Appliance Stores, Weekly 3, first place to Angela Wilson, Central City Leader News. Weekly 3, second place, Beth Holmes and Diana Withers, Adair County Community Voice. And in Weekly 3, Third place to Beth Holmes, Diana Withers, Adair County Community Voice. Multi-weekly, first place goes to Matt Stivers, The Sentinel News. In second place under multi-weekly, it's Kim Huffman, Kentucky Standard. And multi-weekly, third place, Melissa Johnson, Harlan Daily Enterprise. Hardware Appliance Stores, Daily 2, first place to Tony Atkins. The Daily Independent. Daily 2, second place goes to Ryan Schull, the News Enterprise. And in third place, it's Mary Latek, the State Journal. Category 4, Financial. Weekly 1. First and second place both go to Daryl Taylor and Deborah Garrett from the News Democrat. In third place, Kim Huffman, Springfield Sun. Weekly 2, first and second. Both go to Allison Shepherd with the LaRue County Herald News. Weekly three, first place goes to Kim Huffman, Lebanon Enterprise. Second place goes to Kim Huffman and Eva Jo Nugent with the Lebanon Enterprise, and they take third place as well. Multi-weekly, it's a clean sweep. Donna Wilhite from the Kentucky Standard takes first, second, and third. Daily one, first place goes to Wanda Paul, Middlesboro Daily News. Wanda takes second place as well. Daily two, first place goes to Tony Atkins, the Daily Independent. Tony takes second place as well. Third place goes to Mary Latek, the State Journal. Student Publications Class 1, first place to Bryce Anglin, Murray State News. 
Student Publications Class 2, first place Ryan Goodlett, College Heights Herald. Second place goes to the staff of the Kentucky Colonel. In third place, it's Abby Norville, College Heights Herald. Category 5, Professional Services. Weekly 1, first place goes to Kim Hupman, Springfield Sun. In second place, Daryl Taylor and Jeff Moore, the News Democrat. And in third place, Sarah Tackett and Sam McClanahan, Falmouth Outlook. Weekly 2, first place honors go to John McLeod and Trish Jenkins, Cynthia and a Democrat. Second place, Allison Shepherd, LaRue County Herald News. In third place, Janet McKee, Grant County News. Weekly three, first place to Beth Holmes and Diana Withers, Adair County Community Voice. Second place, Bill Mathers and Amanda Richards, Casey County News. Third place, Beth Holmes, Diana Withers, Adair County Community Voice. Multi-weekly, first place and second, both go to Matt Stivers, Sentinel News. Third place goes to Kim Hupman, Kentucky Standard. Daily one, first place to Wanda Paul, Middlesboro Daily News. Wanda takes second place as well. Third goes to Wanda Paul, Middlesboro Daily News. Daily two, first place to Bill Mathers, News Enterprise. Second place, Mary Goldie, The Daily Independent. In third place, it's Jamie Barnes and Nancy Farmer at the News Enterprise. Student Publications, Class 2, first place to Craig Ostertag, College Heights Herald. Second place, the staff of the Kentucky Colonel, and the Colonel staff takes third place. Category 6, Food and Alcohol. Weekly 1, first place goes to Sarah Tackett and Sam McClanahan, Falmouth Outlook. Second place goes to Daryl Taylor and Jeff Moore, the News Democrat. Weekly one, third place goes to Sarah Tackett, found with Outlook. Weekly two, first place to Janet McKee, Grand County News. Second place goes to Allison Shepard, LaRue County Herald News. Allison takes third place as well. Weekly three, first place goes to Bill Mathers and Amanda Richards, Casey County News. Bill and Amanda also take second and third. Multi-weekly, First place goes to Kim Hupman, Kentucky Standard. And Kim takes second place and third place as well. Daily one, first place to Wanda Paul, Middlesboro Daily News. Daily two, first place goes to Tony Adkins, The Daily Independent. Second place, Tony Adkins, The Daily Independent. And in third place, Tony Adkins, The Daily Independent. Student Publications, Class Two, First place to Craig Ostertag, College Heights Herald. In second place, it's Craig Ostertag, also from the College Heights Herald. Category seven, furniture, weekly one. Second and third place both go to Kim Hupman, Springfield Sun. Weekly three, first place goes to Beth Holmes and Mindy Arberry, Adair County Community Voice. Second place goes to Beth Holmes and Diana Withers, Adair County Community Voice. Multi-weekly first place honors to Kim Hupman, the Kentucky Standard. Kim takes second place as well. Daily one, first place to Wanda Paul, Middlesboro Daily News. Daily two, first place to Tony Atkins, the Daily Independent. Second place goes to Tony Atkins, the Daily Independent. Third place, Mary Latek, the State Journal. Category eight, real estate. Weekly one, first place goes to Kim Hupman, Springfield Sun. Second place goes to Daryl Taylor and Deborah Garrett, the News Democrat. Third place goes to Kim Hupman, Springfield Sun. Weekly two, first place goes to Susie LaCour and Madison Ward, Cynthia and a Democrat. Second place to Janet McKee, Grant County News, Third place goes to Allison Shepard, LaRue County Herald News. Weekly three, first place to Kim Hupman and Eva Jo Nugent, Lebanon Enterprise. Second place goes to Mary May and Eva Jo Nugent, Lebanon Enterprise. Third place goes to Becky Jones, Hart County News Herald. Multi-weekly, first place to Donna Wilhite, the Kentucky Standard. 
Kim Huffman from the Kentucky Standard takes second place. Third place goes to Kim Huffman, Kentucky Standard. Daily won first place to Wanda Paul, Middlesboro Daily News. Second place also goes to Wanda Paul. Daily two first place goes to Jamie Barnes and Valerie Sarah, News Enterprise. Second place, Mary Goldie, the Daily Independent. Mary Goldie takes third place as well. Category nine, clothing store. Weekly two, first place goes to Janet McKee, Grant County News. Second place goes to Jeff Botkin and Vivian Ertle, Central Kentucky News Journal. Weekly three, first place goes to Angela Wilson, Central City Leader News. Second place, Kim Huffman and Eva Jo Nugent, Lebanon Enterprise. Multi-weekly, first place goes to Kim Huffman, Kentucky Standard. Second place, Kim Huffman, Kentucky Standard. Third place to Matt Stivers, Sentinel News. Daily two, first goes to Tony Atkins, a Daily Independent. Tony picks up second place as well. And third, Student Publications Class 2, first place to Craig Ostertag, College Heights Herald, second place, Staff Kentucky Colonel, third place, Craig Ostertag, the College Heights Herald. Category 10, Multiple Advertiser or SIG Page. Weekly one, first place to the staff of the News Democrat. Second place goes to the staff of the Springfield Sun. And in third place, Sarah Tackett, Falmouth Outlook. Weekly two, first place to Janet McKee, Grant County News. Second place, the staff of the Cynthia Democrat. And in third place, Janet McKee, Grant County News. Weekly three, first place to Mary May and Eva Jo Nugent, Lebanon Enterprise. Second place, Bill Mathers and Amanda Richards, Casey County News. Third place, Kim Huffman and Eva Jo Nugent, Lebanon Enterprise. Multi-weekly, first place to Donna Wilhite, Kentucky Standard. In second place, it's the staff of the Kentucky Standard. And in third, Melissa Johnson, Harlan Daily Enterprise. Daily one, first place to Wanda Paul and Teresa Jackson, Middlesboro Daily News. Wanda Paul and Teresa Jackson from Middlesboro take second place as well. Daily two, second place to Tony Atkins, the Daily Independent. Third place goes to Mary Goldie, the Daily Independent. Student Publications, Class 2, first place goes to the staff of the Kentucky Colonel. Category 11, Healthcare Medical, Weekly 1, first place goes to the staff of the News Democrat. Second place, Kim Huffman, Springfield Sun. Third place goes to Kim Huffman, Springfield Sun. Weekly 2, first place to Susie LaCour and Madison Ward, Cynthia Democrat. Second place to Jeff Botkins and Sonia Foster, Central Kentucky News Journal. Third place goes to Jeff Botkin and Clarissa Delk Booth, Central Kentucky News Journal. Weekly three, first place to Kim Huffman and Eva Jo Nugent, Lebanon Enterprise. Second place goes to Kim Huffman and Eva Jo Nugent, Lebanon Enterprise. Weekly three, third place goes to Bill Mathers and Amanda Richards, Casey County News. Multi-weekly, first place to Matt Stiver, Sentinel News. In second place, Donna Wilhite, Kentucky Standard. In third, Kim Huffman, Kentucky Standard. Daily two, first place to Tony Atkins, The Daily Independent. In second, it's Ryan Scholl, The News Enterprise. In third place, it's Jamie Barnes and Portia Oldham, The News Enterprise. Student Publications, Class 2. First place to Mariah Southers, College Heights Herald. Second place, the staff of the Kentucky Colonel, and the Colonel staff takes third place as well. Category 12, Entertainment Dining. Weekly one. First place, Kim Huffman, Springfield Sun. Second place, Kim Huffman, Springfield Sun. Weekly two, second place goes to Talon Hampton, Old Amera. Weekly two, third place to Janet McKee, Grant County News. Weekly three, first place, Kim Huffman and Eva Jo Nugent, Lebanon Enterprise. Second place, Becky Jones, Edmonton Herald News. Third place, LaCrucia Kittinger, Central City Leader News. 
multi-weekly. It's a clean sweep. Donna Wilhite from the Kentucky Standard takes first, second, and third place. Daily two, first place to Bill Mathers and Nancy Farmer, the News Enterprise. Daily two, second place goes to Tony Atkins, the Daily Independent. In third place, it's Jamie Barnes and Portia Oldham, the News Enterprise. Student Publications, Class 2, first place to Allie King, Kentucky Colonel. Second place, Brittany Leiden, the Kentucky Colonel. And in third place, Emma Spainhoward, College Heights Herald. Category 13, Special Sections. Weekly 1, first place to Sarah Tackett and staff, Falmouth Outlook. Second place goes to the staff of the News Democrat. Third place goes to Kim Hupman, Springfield Sun. Weekly two, first place goes to Allison Shepard, LaRue County Herald News. Second place goes to Allison Shepard and Zachary Fairfax, LaRue County Herald News. Third place, Janet McKee, Grant County News. Weekly three, first place staff, Adair County Community Voice. Second place and third place both go to the staff of the Lebanon Enterprise. Multi-weekly, first place, Donna Wilhite and staff of the Kentucky Standard. Donna Wilhite and the staff of the Kentucky Standard take second and third place as well. Daily one, first place, Wanda Paul and Mike Grimm and Teresa Jackson, Middlesboro Daily News. Second place, the staff of the Middlesboro Daily News. Daily two, first place, the staff of the News Enterprise. Second place goes to Tony Atkins, Mary Goldie and Joey Shannon, the Daily Independent. Third place goes to Mary Goldie, the Daily Independent. Student Publications, Class 2. First place, Staff, College Heights Herald. Second place of the staff of the College Heights Herald. Third place goes to the staff of the Kentucky Colonel. Category 14, Group Promotion, Weekly 1. First place to Mary Garrison, Henry County Local. Second place, Kim Hupman, Springfield Sun. Third place, Kim Hupman, Springfield Sun. Weekly three, first place, Kim Hupman, Mary May, and Eva Jo Nugent, Lebanon Enterprise. Second place, Kim Hupman and Eva Jo Nugent, Lebanon Enterprise. And third place, Hope Selby, Jennifer Cardwell, and Patrick Dunham, Woodford Sun. Multi-weekly, first place to Donna Wilhite, Kim Hupman, Kentucky Standard. Second place, Kim Hupman, and staff, Kentucky Standard. Third place, Donna Wilhite, Kim Hupman of the Kentucky Standard. Daily two, first place to Tony Atkins, the Daily Independent. Tony takes second place as well. Category 15, political advertising. Weekly one, first place to Kim Hupman, Springfield Sun. Kim Hupman takes second place as well. Third place goes to Kathy Schaefer, Greenup County News Times. Weekly two, first place to Janet McKee, Grant County News. Janet McKee takes second place as well. Third place goes to Allison Shepard, LaRue County Herald News. Weekly three, first place to Lucretia Kittinger, Central City Leader News. Second place to Mindy Yarberry, Adair County Community Voice. Third place to Beth Holmes and Diana Withers, Adair County Community Voice. Multi-weekly, first place to Kim Hupman, Kentucky Standard. Second place, Kim Hupman, Kentucky Standard. And in third, Donna Wilhite, Kentucky Standard. Daily two, first place to Ryan Schull and Amanda Jones, News Enterprise. Second place goes to Jamie Barnes and Nancy Farmer, News Enterprise. Third place, Sonia Foster and Valerie Serra, News Enterprise. Category 16, Agriculture, Lawn and Garden. Weekly one, first place, Kim Hupman, Springfield Sun. Second place to Daryl Taylor and Deborah Garrett, the News Democrat. Third place goes to Sarah Tackett and Sam McClanahan, Falmouth Outlook. Weekly two, first place to Susie LaCour and Madison Ward, Cynthia and Democrat. Second place goes to Allison Shepard, LaRue County Herald News. Third place, Susie LaCour and Madison Ward, Cynthia and Democrat. Weekly three, first place to Angela Wilson, Central City Leader News. 
First place also goes to Bill Mathers and Amanda Richards, Casey County News. Multi-weekly, first place to Kim Hupman, Kentucky Standard. Second place, Donna Wilhite, Kentucky Standard. And second place also goes to Kim Hupman at the Kentucky Standard. Daily two, first place to Mary Latek, the State Journal. Second place goes to Jamie Barnes, the News Enterprise. Daily two, third place, Tony Atkins, the Daily Independent. Category 17, preprint special publications. Weekly one, first place to Kim Hupman, Springfield Sun. Second place, the staff of the News Democrat. Weekly three, first place to Kim Hupman and Eva Jo Nugent, Lebanon Enterprise. Second place, the staff of the Adair County Community Voice. Multi-weekly, first place to the staff of the Sentinel News. Second place goes to Donna Wilhite, the Kentucky Standard. Third place, Melissa Johnson, Wanda Paul, and Mike Grimm, Harlan Daily Enterprise. Daily one, first place, Melissa Johnson, Wanda Paul, and Teresa Jackson, Middlesboro Daily News. Second place, Melissa Johnson, Wanda Paul, Mike Grimm, Middlesboro Daily News. Daily two, first place to the staff of the News Enterprise. Daily two, second place goes to Jamie Barnes and Valerie Sarah, the News Enterprise. Student Publications, Class 2, first place to the staff of the Kentucky Colonel. Second place, the staff of the College Heights Herald. Category 18, Best Use of Color. Weekly 1, first place to Sarah Tackett, Falmouth Outlook. Second place, Daryl Taylor and Deborah Garrett, the News Democrat. Weekly 1, third place goes to Daryl Taylor and Deborah Garrett, the News Democrat. Weekly 2, first place to Talon Hampton, Old Amera. Second place, Janet McKee, Grant County News. Third place, Talon Hampton, Old Amera. Weekly 3, first place goes to Bill Mathers and Amanda Richards, Casey County News. Second place, Lucretia Kittinger, Central City Leader News. Third place, Kim Hupman and Eva Jo Newton, Lebanon Enterprise. Multi-weekly, first place to Donna Wilhite, Kentucky Standard. Donna Wilhite takes second place as well. Third place goes to Matt Stivers, Sentinel News. Daily two, first place to Jamie Barnes and Valerie Sarah, News Enterprise. Second place, Mary Goldie, The Daily Independent. Third place, Mary Goldie, The Daily Independent. Student Publications, Class 1. First place to Bryce Anglin, Murray State News. Second place also goes to Bryce Anglin. Third place to Taylor Duke, The Patriot. Student Publications, Class 2. First place to Craig Ostertag, College Heights Herald. Second place, Rob Fisher, Kentucky Colonel. Third place, Staff, Kentucky Colonel. Category 19, Best Ad Series. Weekly 1, first place, Gloria Hollifield, Lake News. Second place, Kim Hupman, Springfield Sun. Third place, Daryl Taylor and Deborah Garrett, the News Democrat. Weekly 2, first place to Susie LaCour and Rebecca Striplin, Cynthiana Democrat. Second place, Jill McKenzie, Bourbon County Citizen. Third place, Jeff Botkin and Sonia Foster, Central Kentucky News Journal. Weekly three, first place, Angela Wilson, Central City Leader News. Second place, Beth Holmes and Mindy Yarberry, Adair County Community Voice. Third place, Kim Hupman and Eva Jo Nugent, Lebanon Enterprise. Multi-weekly, first place, Donna Wilhite, Kentucky Standard. Second place, Melissa Johnson, Harlan Daily Enterprise. Student Publications, Class 2. First place, Craig Ostertag, College Heights Herald. Category 20, Holiday Greeting Ads and General Miscellaneous. Weekly 1, first place to Kim Hupman, Springfield Sun. Second place also goes to Kim Hupman. And third, it's the staff of the News Democrat. Weekly 2, first place to Susie LaCour and Rebecca Striplin, Cynthia Democrat. Second place, Janet McKee, Grant County News. Third place goes to Susie LaCour and Rebecca Striplin, 
Cynthia and a Democrat. Weekly three, first place to Kim Huffman and Eva Jo Nugent, Lebanon Enterprise. Second place to Kim Huffman and Eva Jo Nugent at Lebanon Enterprise. And weekly three, third place goes to Bill Mathers and Amanda Richards at the Casey County News. Multi-weekly first place honors go to Matt Stivers, Sentinel News. Second place, Kim Huffman, Kentucky Standard. And in third place, Donna Wilhite, Michelle Porter, Kentucky Standard. Daily one, first place, Teresa Jackson, Middlesboro Daily News. Second place and third, both go to Teresa Jackson, Middlesboro Daily News. Daily two, first place to Bill Mathers and Portia Oldham, the News Enterprise. Second place, Jamie Barnes, the News Enterprise. Third place, Mary Goldie, the Daily Independent. Student Publications Class 1, first place the staff of the Patriot. Category 21, Sporting Goods, Athletics. Weekly 1, first place Kim Huffman, Springfield Sun. Second place goes to Kim Huffman, Springfield Sun. Weekly 2, first place to Allison Shepard, LaRue County Herald News. Second place, Janet McKee, Grant County News. Third place goes to Janet McKee. Weekly three, first place, Bill Mathers and Amanda Richards, Casey County News. Second place, Beth Holmes and Diana Withers, Adair County Community Voice. Third place goes to Bill Mathers, Casey County News. Multi-weekly, first place to Donna Wilhite, Kentucky Standard. Second place, Kim Huffman, Kentucky Standard. Third place, Kim Huffman, Donna Wilhite, and Michelle Porter, Kentucky Standard. Daily two, first place to Tony Atkins, the Daily Independent. Daily two, second place goes to Bill Mathers, News Enterprise. Daily two, third place, Ryan Schull and Valerie Sarah, the News Enterprise. Category 22, special events. Weekly one, first place, the staff of the News Democrat. Second place, Kim Huffman, Springfield Sun. Third place, Daryl Taylor and Deborah Garrett, the News Democrat. Weekly two, first place to Allison Shepard, LaRue County Herald News. Second place, Susie LaCour and Rebecca Strickland, Cynthia and Democrat. Third place, Susie LaCour and Trish Jenkins, Cynthia and Democrat. Weekly three, first place to Bill Mathers and Amanda Richards, Casey County News. Second place, Kim Huffman and Eva Jo Nugent, Lebanon Enterprise. Third place, Lucretia Kittinger, Central City Leader News. Multi-weekly, first place, Donna Wilhite and the staff of the Kentucky Standard. Second place, Kim Huffman, Kentucky Standard. Third place, Melissa Johnson, Harlan Daily Enterprise. Daily two, first place, Ryan Scholl and Portia Oldham, the News Enterprise. Second place, Ryan Scholl, The News Enterprise. Third place, Tony Atkins, The Daily Independent. Student Publications, Class 1. First place, Zane Ross, The Patriot. Student Publications, Class 1. Second place, Bryce Anglin, Murray State News. Category 23, Creative Use of the Newspaper, Newspaper Promotion. Weekly 1. First place, Gloria Hollifield, Lake News. Second place, Kim Huffman, Springfield Sun. Third place, the staff of the News Democrat. Weekly two, first place, Janet McKee, Grant County News. Second place, Talon Hampton, Old Amera. Third place, Janet McKee, Grant County News. Weekly three, first place to Kim Huffman and Katie Broyles, Lebanon Enterprise. Second place, Kim Huffman and Eva Jo Nugent, Lebanon Enterprise. Third place, Diana Withers, Mindy Yarberry, Adair County Community Voice. Weekly three, third place goes to Mindy Yarberry, Adair County Community Voice. Multi-weekly, first place, Matt Stiver, Sentinel News. Second place, Donna Wilhite, Kentucky Standard. Third place, Donna Wilhite, Kentucky Standard. Student Publications, Class 2. First place to Brandon Edwards, College Heights Herald. Second place, staff of the Kentucky Colonel. Category 24, Best Online, 
digital ad. Multi-weekly, first place to Melissa Johnson, Harlan Daily Enterprise. Second place, Melissa Johnson, Harlan Daily Enterprise. Third place goes to Donna Wilhite and Kim Huffman, Kentucky Standard. Daily one, first place to Melissa Johnson, Middlesboro Daily News. Second place to Melissa Johnson, Middlesboro Daily News. Daily two, first place to Bill Mathers and Portia Oldham, The News Enterprise. Second place, Ryan Scholl and Valerie Serra, The News Enterprise. Third place to Bill Mathers and Nancy Farmer, The News Enterprise. Student Publications, Class 2, first place to the staff of the Kentucky Colonel. Second place goes to Craig Ostertag, College Heights Herald. Third place also goes to Craig Ostertag. Category 25, Best Online Digital Ad Series. Multi-weekly, first place, Melissa Johnson, Harlan Daily Enterprise. Second place, Melissa Johnson, Harlan Daily Enterprise. Daily one, first place, Melissa Johnson, Middlesboro Daily News. And in second place, it's Melissa Johnson, Middlesboro Daily News. And now for the results from General Excellence. Weekly one, first place, Springfield Sun. Second place, The News Democrat. Third place to The Falmouth Outlook. Weekly two, first place to the Grant County News. Second place, Cynthia Democrat. And third place to the LaRue County Herald News. Weekly three, first place to the Lebanon Enterprise. Second place goes to the Casey County News. And third place, Adair County Community Voice. Multi-weekly, first place, Kentucky Standard. Second place, Sentinel News. Third place, Harlan Enterprise. Daily one, first place honors to the Middlesboro Daily News. Daily two, first place to the News Enterprise. In second place, the Daily Independent. Third place, the State Journal. Student publication class one, first place, Murray State News. Second place, the Patriot. Student publication class two, first place, College Heights Herald. Second place, Kentucky Colonel. 